and welcome. My name is Anthony Harris. I'm a website administrator for RenaissanceRules.com. In this instructional video, we will look into the downloading and installation of the KPIC GNU toolchain for E Squared Studio. To get started, go to the web browser of your choice, and in the address bar, type in kpitgnutools.com. Once the page is loaded, you will notice that there is a user login area. To be able to download the required toolchain, you will have to register with KPIT's website. Once the register page is loaded, it is as simple as filling in the required sections as seen. These sections will also be marked with a red asterisk after the section name. The required sections that will need to be filled out are the customer's name, email address, country of residence, post OS, target OS, target hardware, and intended use of the KPIC GNU tools. For this demo, the host OS and the target OS will be Windows 7, and the target hardware will be the RX MCU. With all the sections filled out, it is time for you to read through the terms and agreements and then submit your registration. Now that you have completed the registration process, it is possible for you to use the username and password that you have created to log in to KPIT's website. When you log in, the login box will disappear and a quick links box will take its place. The download latest KPIT GNU Tools link in this box is where we will find the most up-to-date GNU tool chains. In this link, you will find paths to all the GNU tool chains. For this demo, we will be dealing with the Windows section. Depending upon which MCU group you are wanting to deal with, you will have to look at the preceding characters after GNU to determine which toolchain to download. For this demo, we will download the RX family toolchain. With the toolchain properly downloaded, go ahead and run the executable file as to install it on your computer. You may have to give the application permission to run it on your computer. If you do, go ahead and click Yes. Go ahead and install with default settings and click Next. Another window will pop up and hit Next again. When the installation is complete, another window will pop up and go ahead and click Next. And then on the last window, go ahead and click Finish. Now it is possible for you to go ahead and minimize everything and open up Renaissance E Squared Studio. Go ahead and allow it to define its workspace. Esquared Studio has noticed that there is a new tool chain that has been downloaded and installed, and therefore it's giving you options to go ahead and register. Go ahead and click the GNU Tool Chains one, and then hit Register. A pop-up will let you know that it has been fully integrated into Esquared Studio. And this is how you properly download and install KPIC GNU's tool chain into Renaissance Esquared Studio.